Hey guys, what's happening? So, did a couple of videos about this Raptorium setups I uh, yeah, built in the last few days. And I'm actually designing a box for this one right here. But, um, actually one last night, one of my uh, my rigs thermal throttled. So I wanted to start playing with the uh, undervolt and uh, overclock settings to run the, well, I'm trying to lower the temperature down just a little bit. All right, so here's the one that thermal throttled last night. So what happened was, uh, you know, I logged in, woke up this morning. I mean, today's a super hot day. I mean, it's it's, it's November. And we have some like a, some kind of fire in Santa winds here. I'm in Costa Mesa, California. But um, so this one, yeah, like last night I came in, I noticed that my my whole rig stopped mining, and uh, it said on the uh, on the BIOS the the boot screen, uh, the CPU uh, over temp. And, you know, press F1 to continue. So it stuck, so it stopped mining at some point last night, or probably this morning when it got hot. Um, but that, this is actually a 5800 x didn't hear anybody about that one. So, this one is actually currently mining at about 78 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to try to bring that down a little bit, I'm going to undervolt that a little bit. Maybe bring up the clock a little bit. Um, Alright, yeah, that's a nightmare. Do You come in and, and your whole rig is shut off. Not just the CPU, but all my GPUs are not mining. So, okay, so the first feature I'm going to disable. Um, is the precision boost overdrive and that's actually going to make it a little bit more stable so it doesn't fluctuate so much oh. hit that disable alright so to change this it's kind of uh, it took me a couple seconds to figure it out but you don't use your mouse settings right you actually use the uh, plus and minus thing on a keyboard because if you double click on it it's not going to do anything right so you have to use the uh, plus or minus on the keyboard right there so see, minus, plus. I'll make that 3,800. Coming out up to 3,800. Uh, and this is actually the multiplier. So the multiplier is like uh, 34 times 100. 3.4 gigahertz. Okay, so I hope you can see this, we're not getting too much uh, stuff here. So I'm actually going to be changing the uh, V-Core down to 1.1 uh, volt. That's actually going to run the, make the CPU run cooler. Uh, so like I said, it's a plus and minus key on your keyboard. Alright, 1.1 volt. I'm going to go back and I'm going to save it and reboot this thing. Yes, I want to make sure it reboots. All right, so those are my overclock settings. So on the uh, the frequency, 3.8 gigahertz, 1.1 volts. The, the core clock, precision boost overdrive disabled. That's going to make it the hash rate more stable, hopefully. And uh, we're going to go back into Windows and uh, start hashing again, see what happens. All right, so I'm back here in Windows, and let's do a run as administrator. Yes. All right, here we go again. So let this run, but uh, like I said, every single motherboard, the BIOS settings are different. They're even named differently, so uh, you saw how I did it in the Gigabyte BIOS. The only thing is, like I said, it doesn't say anywhere specific. Uh, so when you go to the, over to the auto on the clock multiplier, just use the plus and minus sign. But uh, I'm let this run for a couple days and see what happens. Hopefully I can lower my temperature down a little bit and get a little bit more hash rate. Alright, cool.